Okay, there's gonna be some noise in the background there because uh, there's construction going on in the backyard over the fence. Building's going up. Like, I mean, right over the fence. Like, if I jumped the fence, I'd be in the construction area. Like, really. Like, I show you right here, watch. Like, I'm, I'm sitting down outside, but watch this. You see part of that building going up. They're up there welding the, the metal trusses. Yeah, so what we got here is uh, my tech wash and my direct wash, or yeah, tech wash and my wash. So I gotta wash my, my rain jacket first, then I'm gonna apply the tech wash. This is from Nick Wax. So we're gonna use this stuff to apply to my Marmot Minimalist jacket, my rain jacket. Yeah, so I got everything done up. You zip up the front, zip up the pocket, zip up the side pocket. So this thing's been wetting out. So when I go out in the rain, if I'm hiking, I don't care if it rains or not, I just go out. So I've tested it twice now in the rain. When I went out, when it was raining, it's been going for a walk. This was wetting out. This no longer is doing what it's supposed to do. Yeah, so. And this is a Gore-Tex. This is a Gore-Tex rain jacket. This is my only jacket I own. I own no other jacket because I do layers. I'm a, I'm a layer. We do layers. This is my winter jacket. This is my, my rain jacket. This is my go-to jacket. So, yeah. So we're gonna go and uh, apply these, and I'll like when I go, well, I'll go inside and I'll show you what, what it looks like. We'll see. If it's a little noisy out here. We're gonna apply some water to it. And I'm gonna show you how it wets out. Then after it's all done, we'll do a video and we'll see how the water repels off of it. Later. So I'm just showing you. Uh, if you look at that jacket. If you look really uh, close at it. The water doesn't beat off of it. It's, it's just wet, you know. It's, it's, it's. Hopefully, you can see that. There's, there's no bead to it. There's no. There's no bead, so we're gonna do the wash, then we're gonna apply the water repellent, revive the jacket. So, we're back inside again. So I completed the wash of my jacket. So yeah, like I said, I used my, uh, the tech wash, used the tech wash uh, first. So I used, used half of that, because I did a low setting low level uh, water setting and then I used all of this I used all this which it called for the only thing I found I did another rinse though because when I brought this out I had white residue on it which was weird so yeah so but it's all off after the second rinse yeah so and I, I did find it a little tacky so it says you can dry it I start I, then I just took it outside because it was sunny and windy out so I dried it outside I just stuck it in the dryer again because I had this inside out. I just find inside the liner is a little tacky, a little sticky. So I don't know if that's going to wear off. I'm pretty sure it is. So I'll make sure what I do is I'll wear an older shirt before the first time I wear this, a crappy shirt, just in case. But it shouldn't affect anything. But yeah. So yeah. So what we're going to do, since I, and the jacket for some reason too, when I washed it, like right now, it feels lighter. The jacket feels lighter, it's weird. So yeah, what we're gonna do, I'm gonna turn the camera down here. I'm gonna run some water under it. We're gonna show you how the, we'll see how the, before this thing would wet right out, so we'll grab a sleeve here, pull it out here. Grab a sleeve. Let's see what we got here. Got some water running, let's see what we got. Yeah, this is, Yeah, so I'm impressed with that. I can't wait to take this out in the rain. Yeah. Just, it does exactly what it's, that's crazy. That's, uh, yeah. Yeah, water runs right off of it. It's beating up. 
So it's really uh, it's really wetter up here, you know. Yeah. As you can see, I'm letting the water run on that. Right? Yeah, that's that's crazy. So I would say that's a that stuff works perfect. So I'm impressed with that. That's a yeah. You see the see the water beating up on it. That runs right off. You know, before that, that wouldn't do that before. There's no, that was a whoop, anyway. yeah. So I'm in. So I've never. I've always washed it with regular soap for my laundry strips, and I've washed it several times and threw it in the dryer real quick. It's never had a problem until I went out in the rain this year twice and it just wet through so I can't wait to take that out in the rain now to go for a hike in the rain so what I do I don't care if it's raining out thunder and storm I'm going for it. I have shorts on I just throw that on throw that up over my the, the hood up I'm gone so I went out twice now got caught in the rain one time I started right off in the rain the jacket wetted out before I got very far but once I got up to the block the, the one corner it was it was wet it was wet the whole jacket was soaked but it did dry fast but i'm impressed with that so that stuff here yeah the the wash and the tech wash yeah like i said i used a whole thing of this so this year i'll save this is half in here so i gotta remember so if i ever get the jacket dirty i'll hold on to this i, I don't like storing stuff because i'm a minimalist i like to just use things and use it once so that's gone so hold on to this so if this jacket gets dirty again i'll just wash it with this and that should still keep the tech wash on there i guess yeah the neck whack tx direct washing yeah water whatever it is but yeah so i'm impressed with this can't wait to, like it's working under the water tap so i'm pretty sure in the regular rain it should have no problem well later <laughs>